Hi guys! So today I'm going to be doing a video about some recent swimsuit tops that I just got from Victoria's Secret. They had their end of season sale and I think they still are having some sales if you go to the website. Um, I bought everything online and three, yeah, no, two out of three things that I bought online actually did fit me so I'm really happy about that because I know swimsuit tops can be difficult. Um, so I'm going to put links to where you can find everything down below in case you like something. Um, and yeah, the only, there's one that I returned which I will talk about in a moment. But, right, so everything's from Victoria's Secret and the first one that I got, before I start I just want to say what my preferences are really fast. Because um, if you have similar, similar ones you might want to pay extra attention. Um, I hate padding in my bathing suits. I just think that I don't wear even padded bras. So to me a padded bathing suit is just the most annoying idea when I'm at the beach <laughs> running and going swimming. It just sounds horrible to me. So all of these bathing suits, even though they are from Victoria's Secret, don't have padding. Which is kind of hard to find, but um, nevertheless here they are. <laughs> but this is the first one and it has a scalloped top and bottom and the scalloped part is very thin and it ties at the top and these straps are actually non-removable so it's not meant to be a bandeau which I like. I, I Those make me nervous. I feel like they're gonna come off. Um, so this is just a gorgeous um, pretty turquoise color and the scallop top just somehow makes it just that much more comfortable and feel like it kind of forms to your body and it really fits well and the reason why it fits so well is that they sell this one in bra sizes so you can get it in exactly what your bra size is that way if you buy it off the website you know it's gonna fit you and the band and everything is just perfect because it is your size unlike small medium large sizings where that can be a little bit more difficult to fit. So there's this one and I actually just bought the top. I didn't buy a matching bottom. This one I just wear with a plain black bottom with some frills that I already had. So yeah, this is my most comfortable one that I own. So um, if you are a little bit busty, these are good recommendations. Because the plain triangle top just doesn't do it for me. Bandos, no. Strapless, no. None of that works for me. Okay. So, this is another one. Sorry, I had it unhooked. So this next one is a style that is kind of new for this season. I haven't seen this before. Sorry, I keep touching my hair. It's new for this season. I've never seen it. And it was on sale. And it's super comfortable, although it might give you funny tan lines. And it's... This style, and of course you're going to be able to tell how it looks on if you go to the website. I'm not going to like try it on right now, but um, it's like a crop top style where on the, it's kind of like a triangle, but then it has the extra layer that goes um, underneath, and then the back has two straps. That go across if you can tell and this is like a gorgeous bubblegum pink color and it's so soft and so comfortable it has like the basic um, thin pads that come in bikinis that you can take out if you want absolutely no padding but um, it is not like a push-up style or anything like that um, so I got this in a large and it does fit me I just have to tighten the straps a lot um, but I think that if you are a C or a D, you can get, go with the large, but if you don't mind um, showing a little bit more, the straps would fit you better in a medium. So that's just my insight. But I love this, and it's, it's supportive, it's cute, and I'm actually going to wear it with a bottom, to show you really fast because I think it's adorable. I have this bottom that's not from Victoria's Secret because I've had it for a while, but it's a galaxy print. And it just has like the stars, you know, like a galaxy would. And it just looks really cute with this top, so. Yeah, 
that's my other one. And then the last one I got is just a more basic, um, it's just a basic black, it, it seems like a triangle top, but this actually has an underwire. And this one also comes with, comes in your bra size. So if you buy it off the website, you can be very confident. And this comes in tons of different patterns. I just got basic black. Um, so it'd be easier to mix and match. But it has a really cute ruffle detailing at the top. And yeah, so because it comes in a bra size, like I said before, this is an amazing fit. And it is really cute and very comfortable. And this one also has the very light removable padding, but no push-up. So, yeah. And I wear that one with this top that, I mean, with this bottom that I've had for a while also. Just figured I'd show you. Um, looks kind of cute with the plain black top. But this bottom is from Tilly's. Okay, so the last bathing suit um, that I ordered online, I don't have with me because I actually just returned it, but I just want to talk a little bit about it. It is called the Black Rash Guard, and if you've ever seen like a scuba diver where they have kind of like a tight, that like scuba suit material look, well they actually have on the Victoria's Secret website kind of like a crop top. It came to about here, like it showed your whole stomach, but it was a t-shirt. Um, and it just completely covered like a t-shirt would this whole area and it was supposed to be tight and look a little bit like a surfer girl type thing and I thought that would be perfect for when I want to be more covered up if I go to surfing classes or if I swim laps in the pool I thought it would be really good and I got it in a size large which surprisingly the large in the bubblegum pink top that I showed you did fit me but for some reason the rash guard um, the rash guard top was just huge on me. It didn't fit at all. Um, and also, I really would not suggest that top for anyone that has boobs. I'm just going to say it because there's nothing that will hold your boobs where they're supposed to be in that top unless you get it so small that it's like squeezing everything in. Which, I guess that's how a scuba suit is, so maybe I should have got a smaller medium and tried that. Um, but usually I am a large with those type of things. So if you are on the website and looking at those rash guards, I would go a size smaller just because it's like a t-shirt and you will kind of fall out of it because <laughs> there's nothing holding you in place with that. So um, yeah, that's, that's all that I wanted to say. Yeah, so if you have similar concerns about coverage and you might be in the D range of um, C or D range bathing suits, I would definitely try out those from Victoria's Secret um, right now while they're having deals. And yeah, it's just better to shop online with them because in the store I just find that they don't have as many of those swimsuits and definitely not as many options. So yeah, that's all for this video. Hope you guys liked it. Bye! And... Um... And this... What was I gonna say? Oh! Um, 